what's going on everyone Alex De Silva happy as Larry group I hope you're well welcome to another daily dose of happiness it's another rainy dose of happiness today it is raining this morning a tiny little bit not too bad but it's just nice and fresh <clears throat> and uh, just wanted to check in as always as every day and just to see how you are and hopefully you're having a good week and you're living your life to the max i had a bit of a bit of an experience i think is the word i'm going to use yesterday and it started to highlight a few things for me a few things that i have kind of i've known but chose to ignore and i it's almost like i got to the point where i can't ignore it anymore i think all the signs are there you know when kind of the stars align it's almost that's how it feels for me it feels like everything is aligning and i'm just it's almost like I've gone into my comfort zone and and I've kind of sag in it. And now I'm fearful to leave that comfort zone and you know and, and to really kind of pursue the next level, you know, with everything that's happened, you know, with the TED talk, with you know, the event that we've had, we've got another event coming up, you know, in, in July and you know we're talking to some incredible people as well. So there is some really beautiful things happening, but the fear is there. You know, the fear to kind of commit, the fear to to really go for it, the fear to just say, you know, stuff it, let's do this. And it's almost like I'm getting to the point where I'm being left with no choice. And um, I want to give myself that choice because one of the things I've learned is there is different ways of control in life. There's kind of the control when things go really badly wrong and you still want to carry on trying to control everything or where you have to take control so you don't miss out on life, you know, you don't miss out on opportunities. And I think that this is where I need to be, is that I need to make sure, you know, that I'm grabbing hold of these opportunities and I'm seizing them because time only moves one way, you know, and I want to make sure that I'm not missing out. And I know that I have, I know that I'm missing opportunities. I know that I've kind of messed up because of my own fears, my procrastination and thinking that, you know, I can do this later. And I've realized that, yes, I can do it later, which later is now. But if I put this off again, then there's something else that I'm putting off and I'm just going to continuously keep doing this, you know, and just kind of sit comfortably. But sitting comfortably is making me feel uncomfortable. It's making me feel quite ill and it's making me feel sad and, and not happy in, in where I am in life. And um, for, for just over a week or so, I couldn't really put my finger on it and I've started to realise yesterday the reasons why. So I will review more very soon. But... The message today is do something for yourself. Don't wait until it's too late, you know, or don't wait for the right time because there is never the right time. I've realized this. There is never a right time, you know, and then if you want something bad enough, you're just going to have to do it, you know, and what's the worst that can happen? Your dreams come true, you know, and that's what I keep saying to myself and that's what I keep getting. So listen, have an amazing day, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world. And as always, be great, be fantastic, and be absolutely amazing. I do these videos to show you that I'm on my journey to, to, to creating my dreams, to creating my success, but it's not easy. You know, it's a continuous journey and it takes time and sometimes it gets hard, but I'm documenting all of these things so you can see that the journey is possible for anybody, including yourself. So I'll see you again very soon. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Take care.